President Jacob Zuma has described the late ANC stalwart Oliver Tambo as an inspirational leader who helped create a foundation for democratic South Africa. He was speaking at the icon's birthplace in Kantolo village in Bazana in the Eastern Cape where the celebrations culminated earlier today. Born in this village of Ngandolo in Bizana, Oliver Tambo went on to become one of the country's greatest leaders. In a year in which he would have turned a hundred, his birthday was marked here. Dignitaries from government, leaders from other sectors, and thousands of people turned up to show their appreciation. He dedicated his life to the upliftment and empowerment of the people early on in his life. He was already active in community organizations by age 16 when he became secretary of the Pisana Students Association. Tambo was not only the longest serving ANC leader, he also held the organization together during difficult times. Perhaps a lesson for the party's leadership to do the same as the ANC battles divisions ahead of the elective conference in December. The life of Comrade President O.R. Tambo is truly insp inspirational. He lived for one mission only, to see South Africa free, to see her people united and building an equal, prosperous society with no poverty or inequality. Three weeks ago, a house he used to live in in Zambia was declared a national heritage site, and the state of him unveiled at O.R. Tambo International Airport. Many leaders have also delivered lectures in his memory. While this was a culmination of the year-long activities, other events will continue around the country until the end of the year. Despite Tambo's massive contribution to building a democratic South Africa, sadly, he never lived to see the fruits of his labor, the birth of a new country. Mzondelembej, SAPC News, Mbizana in the Eastern Cape.